Hello, everybody. Today is Thursday, June 23rd. It's 4.13 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to show my computer clock here. Thursday, June 23rd, 4.13 in 30 seconds. The regular session for the futures market is going to close in about two minutes. I bring over the time in sales here. We can see that the E-mini S&P is trading at 2103.50. Before I go any further, first the required disclaimer. Okay, it was quite a good day for the auto trader today. The DAX did really well in a number of charts that we're following. First up, we have the Superenco 14 tick with the DAX, and we have reached our profit goal of 2,000 on two contracts. And it looks like there was positive slippage on this as the goal is 2,000, so uh, pretty good. Here's a couple of more trades earlier in the session. So pretty solid performance uh, in the DAX on the Superenco 14 tick. Okay, next up is the DAX on a 20-second line break chart. And uh, this also hit its goal of 2,000 for the day. No, I'm sorry, the goal on this I raised really high. It ended up making 1937. So, uh, again, a solid performance here on our 20 second line break chart. Okay, next up is the DAX on a 34 second line break chart, and this hit its goal of 2000 with maybe just a tick of slippage. I'll scroll back to some of the trades here. The auto trader can work quite well on a line break chart, kind of similar to Renko bars, but different rules in that they uh, eliminate a lot of the noise. Okay, next up is the E-mini S&P on the Super Renko 8 tick, and that had a single trade good for $900, which is excellent in the E-mini S&P for two contracts. That's $450 a contract or 36 ticks per contract. This was a single trade with pretty good position early in the session and then holding the trade the entire day, which, as you know, is very difficult to do for most traders. Okay, next up is the crude oil on just a regular 10 range, no gap chart. There was two trades, both with a pretty excellent position. As you can see, these are limit orders, and there was a short and a long, and we did 1180 for the day. I think it hit its profit goal of 1200. Let's take a look. Yeah, the goal being 1200, so we had a tick of slippage on the end, two contracts here. Okay, next up is the E-mini S&P on the Super Renko 12 tick. There was a loser and a winner resulting in 475 on two contracts. And then finally, we have our gold futures contract here on the Super Renko 6 tick. And this uh, did 380 on two contracts on a mixture of winners and losers today. That's all for today's video. If you'd like to find out more about the uh, BWT Precision Auto Trader, please visit our website at bluewavetrading.com or send us an email to systems at bluewavetrading.com. Thank you for watching today.